was actually supposed to get my ID on my birthday, which was November 3rd. And I went up there. I was unable to get it because, like, my paper was missing. I'm wearing my pink, my light pink, um, fine girl track suit and my baby fat earmuffs today. But I don't know if I'm going to wear them because I got makeup on my wig and I wanted to get on them and they white because they white. It's 9.45 right now. I'm going to be done by 10 o'clock. So... But I'm using this e.l.f. brow gel, brushing my eyebrows. I use a good amount so it could hold. Then I leave them alone so they could dry. Next, primer. I apply it with my hand. Two pumps. Milk Hydro Burp Primer. It's my favorite primer. This is the only primer I use as well. I don't know if I'm going to put makeup on my forehead already. And I use the NARS Ultimate Radiant, the tall bottle of NARS to do my makeup. I do two pumps of it. Like I said, I don't know if I'm gonna put it on my forehead, so I'm gonna just apply most of it to my lower face, and then we'll see. Using this Morphe brush, pick the rest up off my hand. And now I'm gonna spray my face. Where did I just put it? I spray my face with the Milani Make It Last, the original one. I know they got like two or three. This is just to get the foundation wet. I'm not doing makeup on my forehead. I'm trying to see is it noticeable, really. Not really. Concealer. I saw you. I'm using the Pretty Fresh Concealer by Colourpop. It's a hyaluronic acid one. This one is pretty highlighted. I could put a little bit on my nose. There you go. And I'm using another Morphe brush to blend it out. Just. I don't um, spray my face when I do this step because the foundation just got blended in. You don't really need to spray your face at the every application or whatever. You see, I work from the bottom to the top because I put my eye concealer down first, but I blend from what I put down last. So what I put down first. This right here, I really need to do a TikTok of me like deep panning these. So not like not like scraping them out, but like popping them out of this and put it in a deep palette. Like when I'm in this palette because when I lose this, my life is over. Like I couldn't find this for a good minute, and I was so mad. This is my perfect contour shade. Obviously, I, I put pan on this shade. I use the fuck out this shade. Like, it's a big ass circle in the middle. Because when I used to go to school, I used to use this palette a lot. Like this, like I used to put concealer on before I went to school. And I used to set it with this powder because I used to look so dead and then I would look so awake. Also on TikTok, do y'all be watching them little Family Guy clips that be popping up? Well, I know it's a for you page, so it's based on the content that you interact with. But it don't matter what clip pop up, I will watch it. <laughs> and I I can't see myself watching the full episode of Family Guy because I hate all them cutaways. But like with the little clips on TikTok, with like the three minute clips on TikTok, that's just enough for me. I need to get a powder puff so bad. That's all the powder I'm gonna do. Well, my smile line, so I'm gonna do them. 
I used to always bake my smile lines because I did not want them to crease. But now I don't bake them more. I mean, my skin is dry. It's been dry forever. But I really used to, if you look at my first, I have a full makeup tutorial of how I do my makeup face routine. You'll be like, damn. So now I'm gonna contour. I need to set by my nose a little bit, hold on. Like, I just touched it. I didn't like that. I didn't like the way it felt. Contour. Like I said, this is my perfect contour shake. So that's why I gotta take out this pan. Cause look. Oh, I'm pretty sure my brush had other stuff on it before. I dug into this, but that's fine. Hey, look. Yeah, it definitely did, but it's fine. Because the other contour that I was using when I couldn't find this was is way too dark, way too muddy, like you can see. But look, let me show y'all my hack of how I fix this. If you feel like you applied too much contour, like this take my brush off I'm gonna try to bring it out a little more just tap at it tap at this one too I'm gonna apply my blush right now just so it'll blend more easily and for blush I just mix like these top ones You need to have a stippling brush if you want to get rid of that. There's a hair. So here's a stippling brush. Spray your face with the regular side spray. And then stipple. And you see it look way better. Like it don't look like a big and to clean it up now I don't clean up that much anymore but I'm gonna do it today because I put too much I'm gonna just use this shade right here to clean it up and the same brush I use to set my powder I'm just gonna swirl under I'm gonna set under my eyes again face routine is basically done i just need to do my eyes with the, with the sweet talk palette i'm using this shade well i don't know that's not the shade name i know for a fact but it's this little glittery shade on this angle that's it i'm not gonna take this off until you know i got my i'm gonna change my clothes real quick yeah.